So after my 9 to 5, I went here. Then I waited 3 hours with these cool sneaker enthusiasts in line. And then I finally copped the Nike Air Max 97 Silver Bullet. Stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome to Casa Station where we talk sneakers. My name is Zoe, and if you're here for the first time, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any dope sneaker content. What you've all been waiting for, the Nike Air Max 97, aka Silver Bullet. Boom! Glad that I caught these guys from Undefeated and SF. The three hour wait was worth it. I got pooped on in line if you can even believe that. But shout out to all the sneaker enthusiasts that I chopped it up with and congrats to those who caught. But anyways guys, the on feet to these Nike Air Max 97 are currently up right now so go ahead and watch that. It's the best I've ever done, I guarantee it. But anyways, enough blabbing, let's get straight into the sneaker review. So on the insole of the shoe, you'll notice the Nike insignia. On the outside of the shoe, going to the tongue, you'll notice that it's made out of mesh. The Nike symbol is embroidered at the top, surrounded by Nubuck with a little pull tab as well. In addition to that, you have the eyelets on the side that are hidden, which is a cool touch to the shoe. Also, you have 3M stitched into the tongue to help hold the shoelaces as well. So the upper is predominantly made up of synthetic material and mesh. In addition to that, the main color of the sneaker is metallic silver, but it also has hits of varsity red around the shoe. If you look at the midsole of the shoe, you can see that it's surrounded by the traditional air unit of the Nike Air Max 97, and the bottom of the shoe is covered in rubber material as well, with the Nike insignia noted at the sole of the shoe. On the heel of the shoe, you'll also notice Air Max stitched into the pull tab, which is a pretty cool touch as well. What stood out to me when it came to this particular sneaker was the 3M. Not so much the 3M, but the amount of 3M that was added to the shoe. It was subtle, it wasn't too much, it wasn't too little, it was just right. <laughs> I sound like Goldilocks in the three pairs right now. But anywho, the subtleness of the 3M on this particular sneaker made it a must cop for me. So the retail price of the Nike Air Max 97 is going to be $160. Also, in regards to sizing, I suggest going a half size up. Usually I wear a 12 and a half US, but for this particular pair of sneakers, I had to get a 13 and that fit me just right. Casa question of the day. Will you guys be copying the Nike Air Max 97 this weekend? Why or why not? Also, let me know down in the comment section whether you guys like the Nike Air Maxes in general. Let's talk about it, guys. Hey guys, so my sneaker talk is up for today. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching my video. I appreciate all of you guys. And remember, watch the on feed to the Air Max 97 that's currently up so that you guys could get an idea of what it looks like on feet. But anyways, I'll see you guys on the next episode of Casa Station. Deuces. Hey guys, if you want to watch more sneaker videos that are dope sauce, go ahead and subscribe by clicking the link down below that says Casa Station. My name is Zoe, and until next time, deuces.